potentially frustrating at times as you try to get any sort of consistent read on what Wonder Boy is trying to do. Well, he's got a pretty good sidekick, and you saw it right there. He did it great, and it pushed his opponent back. Notice how it creates space and allows him to get back to where he's coming from. Touches the Thompson chin there. Huge block there. Why well, good to see Cedar Wonderboy Thompson back on the proven ground tonight and popping off that jab right out of the shoe. It's his best weapon. I mean, it dictates everything for Stephen Wonderboy Thompson because it tells him when he gets a read and he gets the range on the jab, he starts to throw his kicks. He's a phenomenal fighter, and he has a puzzle that not many people have been able to solve. All right, so we have got a full-on brawl to start this fight. Any concern that these guys might burn themselves out? Oh, they're going to exhaust themselves. So we may as well enjoy it right now, because come the third round, regardless of the weight class, they're going to look like two tired heavyweights in the middle of the octagon. Oh, that's a big hook to the chin. Oh, Stephen Wonderboy Thompson lands. Beautiful to watch him just measure that shot and land it with such ease. He really shows you the record. Oh, this fight's going to be over. What a great way of mixing up his attack. He didn't stay the course. He mixed it up. He went high because the opponent thought he was going low, and now he's got him hurt very badly. Man, this is crazy, DC. These fighters are not trying to just touch each other. They're trying to put each other out with every shot. John, with every shot, these guys are trying to end the fight. What a start. Big right hand. Two minutes have expired in our opening round. Well, I'm no fighter, but if I rock a guy to that extent, I feel like I'm closing the show. Absolutely. You got to go close the show if you get a guy hurt that bad. You cannot back off and take your time. He's right for the picking. Go and pick the fruit. <laughs> 32 total strikes have now landed for one of the best to ever. He's got a huge strike right there. I'm not sure how many more of these his opponent can take. Massive shot that he landed. Great job. Nice block. Thompson's eye starting to close up. Got to get that end swell on it between rounds if we get there. Yeah. Whiffs on the elbow. Oh, nice. Two minutes to go. Oh, now lands a kick to the body. Nice job by the fighter here to continue to block the shots coming his way. You think he's trying to sort of fatigue his opponent here a little bit? He's kind of watching and seeing everything that's happening in front of him. Later, you'll see him start to throw counters after blocking shots. Well, now you see some visible damage on the side underneath the elbow. He told us he was going to invest in the body. He hasn't missed a whole lot tonight. You didn't expect him to do it this effectively. He's done a fantastic job of following the game plan. Oh, Stephen Thompson with a beautiful combination. His father, Ray, longtime chief corners, got it like that. All right, so that opened up a cut around his eye area. He hasn't moved his head well. He was taking shots too clean, and now a cut has opened up. Looks like someone took a red sharpie to his side. A lot of bruising courtesy of those body strikes. Well, big kicks, big kicks. <laughs> His opponent compromised this year. It's one thing to land a hard shot. It's another thing completely to land a perfect shot. That was a perfect shot. 45 seconds to go here in round one. All right, we'll see if he has any response here. His opponent continues to land. A lot of swelling upstairs. Well, you got to move your head. You've got to be preemptive. You cannot wait until your opponent starts to throw something in your direction. You've got to avoid right now if you want to avoid having this become an issue. Oh, that'll snap your head back. Beautiful combination. Coming, it's blocked. Five minutes in the books. Nice work out there. The strike was on a whole nother level. 
another level. Well, he certainly added to his highlight reel in that previous round, DC. A lot of effective kicks there to the bottom. And he did a great job of setting up those kicks. He's not throwing blind body kicks. He's not just throwing the kick. He's throwing it behind jabs. He's throwing it behind punches, making his opponent think high, and then blasting that kick right into his opponent's body. You ready to fight? Ready. Go. All right. Round two. Strong, physically ready to fight. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Devastating body kick land. Lee's strike attempt there is blocked. Oh, working the body with that kick again. Trying to go to the body now with the kick. That one misses. Wow! Well, the most significant stat in this fight has been body strikes. And at times in the past, maybe you could say he's been a headhunter. But tonight, he has worked the body to great effect. And those are really starting to take their toll. Need some work, guys. Let's keep grinding. Game of inches right there, oh, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. They're so evenly matched. They're going to the attack. Oh, it landed. He hurt him. Also, the taller fighter lands a knee yet again. Lee's head kick looked like that one was blocked. Just over three minutes to go in round two. Nice volume of jabs there by Thompson. All right, so he continues to land a high volume of strikes. You know, sometimes when you play basketball, you're in the zone. Mm -hmm. This dude's in the zone. This guy's throwing his basketball in the midst of the ocean. He can't miss with anything that he throws. Every kick lands. Every punch lands. He has just outclassed this guy on the feet. You have got to find a way to change the way that this fight is playing out, or your night's going to end very early. Come on. Well, that body kick was there earlier, not there on that attempt. And there it is again, targeting that swelling. Why would you not, right? You doled out all this damage. Might as go, might as well go right back to it. Well, especially if your opponent is not gonna move his head. He's still trying to go out on his shield. He's he's so stubborn in trying to prove that he's tough. It's really costing him right now. Oh, and he lands yet another knee. And sometimes it pays to be the taller fighter, DC. I know you can't necessarily. There's the jab. Now another for good measure. Nice job there by Lee. Thompson's eye looks so swollen now. You've got to at least speculate as to whether or not that is a fractured orbit. All right, so a good series of kicks by him there. He has mixed it up beautifully, I think, on the feet tonight. He is. I'm not sure his opponent knows where he is. No, he doesn't know where he is. He's hurt real bad. And that punch landed was in the perfect spot. his feet. Oh my goodness. Massive left hand. So a much different approach from him here in round two. Took him a while to find the range, get in his striking rhythm. He has found it here, and as a result, has really picked up the pace in round two. And he caught the kick. We'll see what he can do. With it. I mean, you gotta be kidding me with that knockout. If that is not the number one play on Sports Center tonight, I'm not sure what would top it. One of the best knockouts we've seen all year. In a very long time. I have not seen someone look this good. He promised us something, and he delivered with that beautiful knockout.
The official decision is now in. Here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean's called a stop to this contest at four minutes, one second of the second round. Declaring the winner by knockout and new undisputed UFC welterweight champion of the world, Bruce the Dragon. Mixed martial arts royalty, folks. Bruce Lee, lighten up your living room tonight and giving this capacity crowd a whole lot to cheer about. You know he's going to get everyone's best shot, but more often than not, Lee's skills are enough to rue the day. That was once again the case in this one. How about Bruce Lee?